What's poppy, y'all? It's Triller from the 615. Now, let's just get right into what we got going on today. So, you know, since Dolph Death, there's been a lot of these folks got some do it, these folks got some do it, she set them up, he set them up, they set them up. It's just been a whole bunch of, you know, just back and forth. But let's actually play devil's advocate or Facebook detective, investigator, conspiracy theorist, whatever you want to call it. Let's play that for a second, right? And let's go with the idea that Makita's Cookies owners set the family daughter whatever set up young dog first thing let's find out what would be the reason for them to set up young Dolph. okay um i can't find a reason why they would set up young Dolph, but i can find a reason why they wouldn't set up young Dolph. um for one he's driving traffic to this business uh the biggest one if not one of the biggest rappers in the city is driving traffic to your business um you didn't get no money out of it because when they shot these folks, when, when these folks shot them, they took off. Did nobody get a bag or nothing? And that, and, and so that turns, that, that, that leads, that, that robbery shit is out the window. It would have to be a hit. It would have to be somebody, somebody wants you dead for a reason to pull up broad day at that time. On this street right here, let's look at this street. This, this ain't just a, uh, uh. Uh, a weak ass street where ain't shit going on, no businesses. This, this, this is a decent amount of street. If you look at the traffic right here, I'm pretty sure it get worse than that. So it, it, it's folks around here. You feel me? So why would somebody pull up broad day and do this shit? Now, but again, we playing Facebook detective, advocate, whatever you want to say. Let's say these folks did set them up, right? These folks invited him to the cookie shop. Now, that's one point. Do you think Dolph was invited or Dolph just came to the cookie shop? Let's say they invited him. They invited him to the cookie shop, right? He pulled up at the cookie shop. Dude's pulling behind him. They shoot the glass out the motherfucking uh, cookie shop. I mean, shoot every inch of glass out that motherfucker. So, after they shoot the glass out, Dolph is dead. They got a board up there. The, 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 they got a board up the business. They lose money over the, for the next few weeks or months or whatever. Folks scared to come right now. And the funny shit is, there's a laundry uh, uh, business uh, right next to it. I think it's right here too. Is that it? Yep, yeah, there you go, right there. He did a news interview. that black, It's a black, old black dude who owned that. He's saying they losing business around there. The reason why folks don't want to come around there... Um, uh, cause uh, the the violence and uh, uh, people just don't feel comfortable going around there because it reminds them of what happened right there. So his business is taking a hit. So you mean to tell me, killing Young Dolph is gonna bring more traffic to your business? It just don't make sense to me. Like, wh why would that happen? Now, this is why folks are saying uh, these folks set him up. I, I, this is the reason why people are actually not really just saying anything, but they kind of alluding to the fact that these folks possibly killed Dolph. Now, the reason why they say that is because the daughter claims that he was there. The The owner, her father, was there when it happened, and he called her. But in his story, he says he drove up. What's not making sense, though, is the detective, Not the, when the detective Martello did an interview with the lady, she basically said he was there. So, it's two on one. Is the father line or the daughter line? Because, again, the detective who she was, the lady, one of the eyewitnesses who said that she saw some dudes over here run out the back of the family dollar, claimed that she said the owner, the dude, father, was there. But, he says he wasn't. So, if, if, if anything... That should make you suspicious. And and another thing, and this is my last point before I get off. Like I said, we're just exploring these conspiracy theories. I just want to see what everybody else feel about these to see if they cap or because a lot of folks just come up with some shit and I just be like, well, y'all get that from. So here's another thing. This woman, which is the daughter, is doing like interviews and She's all over the, the, the... I'm not saying her life's supposed to stop, right? But it just seemed like 
she ain't taking it that hard. Now she, why would she? It ain't you get what I'm saying? But it seemed like they fucked with Dolph, like they loved him, cause he was he helped them out. But doing two hour interviews and whatnot. Shout out to Westbrook right here. He been growing a skull. But doing doing that, like doing interviews for two hours, is, what you talking about? What, what, what going on? Y'all think they set him up for promo? I don't know, man. I'm just kind of, I'm just kind of going on a limb and just saying anything at this point. Just trying to see where everybody else is at with this um, video. Five minutes. I'm gonna get on out of here. It's Triller from the six one five.